Hi everyone, gonna keep it short and sweet because I'm absolutely exhausted. Um, it's unfortunately already July 12th. I am so tired. Um, my son got back from Canada and then um, he was here just a night and then went off to his grandparents' house to spend time with his aunt and his cousins and uh, had a wonderful day. I was supposed to meet him about halfway into it, but unfortunately, um, I was waylaid, and I'm not gonna name any names on stores. Um, never have had a problem before in the past, but I always use the click and pull, um, especially because of my um, fusion. You know, I don't have to, you know, go up and down the aisles, etc. So um, it's always been a big help in the past. However, something went wrong in the process today, and then it just snowballed, and I ended up being there for like three, four hours, no joke. Um, so really put a dent in um, my plans of spending time with my family today, which was unfortunate, but um, I, uh, my son had a great time, so really that's all that counts, but I missed spending time with him, so it's kind of a bummer all the way around, but again, so glass half full though is I ended up spending some time on the phone with um, someone that I uh, used to work um, alongside and with at a different company, but um, at any rate, we got back in touch today, and uh, so she knows that I'm out there looking for work again, and so I guess you just have to look at the glass half full maybe today, and my bad experience today happened for um, a reason, right? You never know. So I'm going to stick with that story. <clears throat> the other story right now is my son walked in the door and went straight to bed. I'm pretty sure he just fell flat out with his clothes on. Um, and I am exhausted and have the unfortunate experience of finishing up this process. So, um, you know, camp, right? Half of it is all about the food. Um, and yes, they feed him. In fact, they feed him wonderful food. But um, as soon as they close the kitchen down, these boys just get so hungry. So uh, we have a suitcase. Um, you know, already packed and all the linens are already in the car, already did all that. And um, I've got about half the suitcase done. I kind of ran out of steam and I had to fill out camp papers. And I mean, it's just really a long process um, for one person to get done. People don't realize, you know, when it's just you that, um, you know, there's nobody else doing anything else. So it's uh, um, a long process. That's all I'm saying. So um, I still have the <laughs> wonderful, wonderful, fun times ahead of um, packing what? Yeah, that camp food that we will be eating after midnight. Normally, I wouldn't let you see my house like this, but I just think it's hilarious. Um, all of this, this goes into what's called just the food suitcase, as my son has named it. Now, yeah, a few odds and ends, like a fan some cutlery, which every other camper always forgets except for us. So um, I get deemed awesome mom, which, you know what, I'll take it. Uh, I don't get it a lot anymore. And so I'll take it as much as I can get it um, anyway. And then of course, there's all the awesome junk food, uh, but you know, some carrots and hummus. So who can complain? Except I can just a little because my son announced, oh no, mom, I don't want the vanilla. I only want the chocolate. So no, he's not that spoiled. I just don't want to carry um, vanilla puddings up if they're not wanted. And I don't want anybody else to either because that'll mean it takes too much time. So I will be removing the vanillas. Um, and you know, hey, shout out yet again. <clears throat> Everybody needs a Coke to get through it, right? Middle school debate camp, and it is uh, worthy of Coke. They're up for a very long time um, and might need just a little caffeine, just a little. So we'll balance that off. I only let them bring a six pack. Um, sorry, son. Um, and better choice, but still same company. Yes, more product placement for the vitamin water so anyway all right enough goofballing around i have so much to do everything's got to get into the food suitcase um and packed properly so that nothing explodes and uh nothing leaks etc etc um 
Yeah, our nanny's coming by very early tomorrow morning to help me with a rest. As you can see, look at this. I mean, I'm exhausted, circles under the eyes. Uh, um, but two people in this process during registration, we will fly through, he will get the best dorm room, and everyone will be happy. So, all right, I would say have a good night, except it's not night. Have a good morning, a good day, and enjoy the rest of your weekend. I will post an update tomorrow and let you know how everything goes. In fact, I might even post a quick video of the mayhem, because um, that's always interesting uh, to see at camp. But uh, he'll have a great time. I'll get a little bit of time off, but I will really miss him so much. So, all right, take care, everybody. Have a great week, weekend. <laughs> Bye.